hello subscribers hello viewers what's up you all uh my name is martin gonzalez martin day trades and today i have a day trade nos 100 review for you guys i took one trade uh kind of okay so guys learn from my this this day for me and going into the market i knew the overall market was bearish yeah, I was waiting for a retracement into a higher fib level for the move down and the market opened it dipped into this area where I was going to buy and I bought it and in hopes it was going to go up, but it just went down 1% loss. It was a really quick trade um, continuation type of day. Uh, these are days that are very kind of hard where we're us smart money traders kind of just stay out of it. But there was moves to be made for the buy and the sell. Uh, buy was uh, yesterday towards end of market open Asian in London. And then we had the sell off today during end of London, uh, beginning of New York and, and the market open. It wasn't a very big day, but let me go ahead and show you guys. What I mean by that is um this is my youtube channel guys go ahead and check it out it's uh martin day trades an entrepreneur's journey and um what we can do from here is go to the nos 100 if you guys want to follow me and uh on youtube uh go ahead take a picture here there's my qr code I'll, you guys can pause this at this point and just take a picture uh, like, comment, subscribe. Uh, if you guys mess DM me, I'll message you back. So this was today's move right here, guys. I was expecting price to have a pullback into the 70 to 79 percent fib level uh, for our bearish order block. It got up to this. It retraced uh, 38 percent. Here's the fib level. retraced about 50 percent and then it continued lower so that was the we missed it and when it got to 50 percent what time was it that was the top of london you guys see that and then it had its consolidation right into the market open and then this nice move like this move was if you got in right here during market open 25 pip stop loss right there you know, we'll, we'll go down to the five minute. You know, if you, you could have got in right at nine, where's 9.30, right here. So let's say you get in like right here, 9.30, um, 25 pip stop loss. It never went higher than that level, guys. And then took this all the way down, which could have been a one to six risk to reward day, 50 pip stop loss. A one to four essentially risk to reward day. A one to four point five essentially premium premium. Uh, one to four between one to f one and four and one four point five. So we missed this trade, or I missed this trade. I missed this trade, guys. We didn't miss nothing. I missed this trade. I took this trade in hopes of it going long, and you guys can see that. Uh, I was looking for a one to two test the Asian session high. Um, as soon as it started going bullish i was expecting price to you know be i was gonna take like two percent off right in this level so tp2 is here so there would have been a little runner let that runner run and then or have like a stop loss move my stop loss to like tp1 or 1.5 and as it goes up just kind of trail it um and then have a short entry here so i was looking to catch the buy to the sell but the buy never it never it, there was just no buy it was just a continuation day right here to right there boom came back up could have re-entered for that same trade idea boom <sighs> so where i was looking at was this four hour bearish order block you guys can see that it's right here boom right into this 79 percent fib which i measured from the five minute chart from this high right here to this low uh, right there and then I just 
brought it all the way out because it just consolidated where is it gonna go i thought it was gonna come back up have a bigger discount than 50 percent but that's why risk management is so important guys i took a one percent loss and i'll tell you guys exactly my entry and my stop loss so history i got in at 1204 1204.80 for the long so where is that right uh, let's go down five minutes five minutes fine um point eight uh and then i had um watch this entry price oh no way I wonder if that's how it works. 50, no. Mm. What was this? 50 pips, guys. And it was a little more. Is that 104? Exactly. So that's about good right there. 104. Uh, 12,054. Is that 12,053.9? Okay. So this is where I got stopped out, guys, real quick. Um, I got in. It came up came up and then or during this moment it went all the way up almost tapped tp1 i should have just moved my stop loss right here right there as soon as it tapped tp1 um and then it came down came back up came down ranged and then a couple minutes later stopped me out right there really fast trade today guys i should really wish i would have just stopped out so canceled my trade early so this is a good analysis guys this is what's going to keep us in the game is reviewing these trades um i'm actually going to clean my charts up after this but uh yeah guys this is my uh this was my day trade nos 100 review lost one percent be back tomorrow remember guys the most important part of trading for you new traders or you or you traders that are going from like beginner to intermediate um is the quicker you learn that you get one trade a day one percent max while you're learning that's what's going to keep you in the game long term until you learn your setups like the back of your hand know when to risk 1.5 percent on a trade to catch a good move all right guys like comment subscribe you uh, be tuned in for the next video.